Hello, children. My name is Ilya2, and welcome back to my Let's Play of EU4, the extended timeline mod with the Rasha Dun. Or, really, the Sunni Empire, the Islam Empire. In the last episode, we pushed into what is um, sass the Sassanids, and slaughtering them, we took over all of Persia and converted it. Now, it was actually extremely easy. A lot more easy than I ever expected. It seems that the rise of Islam is kind of an easy start date. I'm going to assume once there's going to be like Shia, they're going to start breaking off of me and I'm going to have to, you know, try and contain them, you know, keep my empire strong and keep Islam unified. Our only buddy is Sint over here. And that's about it. Our enemy, Byzantium, still stands strong. They are currently at 89. We are at 39. And we can actually increase all the way up to 58. So I think that's what we're going to do in this episode. And possibly, no. I don't think we're going to be able to destroy the Sassanids. How did they still have a vassal? That's hilarious. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to destroy the Sassanids. However, we could begin to push up north, which is what I think I want to do. Because it's all just Tangri land. And I want to start going around Byzantium. Because that's the only way I can really go. Although, I could actually go down here into Axum. Yeah. Yeah, hey, they're still Egyptian. Wow. But yeah. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What's this? Germanic? Actually owns that. Oh, right. Because they're Anglo-Saxons, right. And you still have Druidists. <laughs> Funny. Alright, anyways. Let's continue on. So, right now, we are very low on manpower. Let's just let the game tick on from now. Uh, we have Armenian Separatists ready to rise up. Get up there. Now, because we have the rise of Islam for 20 more years, I think. Uh, 21 more years. We are safe. But we need to be careful not to let revolts happen. <laughs> yeah, that. Exactly that, in fact. Uh, do not let that happen. Um, ooh, that piety, that, the piety really helps. Uh, yeah, we can do that. We don't have that much money, which is another problem. We're going to need money for that, for uh, getting more people. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? Caliphatal subjugation? On the Heptalites, the Caliph is the political and religious leader of all Muslims, but they refuse to accept his authority. Who? Those guys. Oh. Sunni. But they are under Western Gulf Turks. I'm assuming that's what the Turks are. They're pretty powerful, yeah. I don't want to screw with them. Oh, wow. Okay, so you have the Gulf Turks. Any of the Turks. That's weird. That's really weird. Uh, advancements. Oh, right. Emirs. What do we have in a state? So we have the Emirs, the Tyrimi, the Tyrimi, the Merchant Guild, and the Ulema. We, we don't want the uh, Tyrimi because those guys are Christians and Jews who are independent from... Or not independent, but they will never convert to Islam. So I don't want them. I do not want them at all. Uh, house technology. Right, because we are very far ahead of time. So why don't we start making new states? How many states can we have? We can have two more states. Alright, well, might as well go in here. States and territories. Which has the highest highest development? Alright. Oh, Iraq. Okay, so... Iraq. Not exact matches. Iraq... A... Really? What? What is this? Why is it all like this? Iraq a... Ajam. Alright, fine. What? You know what? I know where Iraq is. I'm sure. Is it right here? No, that's Basra. Was Iraq? If only there was an easier way to do this, but there's not. Alright, um... Basra, Basra, Basra. 
Luristan, Luristan. Wait, that's not a state, right? Yeah, it's not a state. And who has the highest development? There it is, Iraqi Ajam. Oh, we don't need a court for whatever reason. No spread of Islam. Good. Good. Helps. That really helps. So I'm assuming the Zoroastrians, they are very easy. They're going to be spread. Uh, the, what am I saying? Islam is going to spread into Zoroastrian very easily. Oh. And Albania. Wait, Albania? Oh, they're Chalcedonians. Okay, never mind. What about you? Can or Have we spread into you yet? No. Sadly not. <sighs> Whatever. Okay, so what other states we got? We have Khorasan. Khorasan. That's Basra. No. Isfahan. Tabaristan. Huh. No idea where it is. Byzantium declared war on Lombardy. Oh. I don't need to know about that. Whatever. All right. Do you Lama want more land? I guess they shall have it then. They can have this. No, they can't. Uh, they can have this land. Good enough? Good enough. Yes. We'll give them the crappy desert land. Yeah, but where is that? I wish they would tell you, Coruscant. Oh, right. That, I couldn't look it up because it's not a province. I'm an idiot. All right, Khorasan, up here, it's Gore, Isafan, Baristan, back into it then, god damn, I hate this, Khorasan, cancel, come on, Khorasan, up here, oh, it's not a core, well, one of them's not a core, let's wait till we core everything then. Claims fabricated. Cool. Discovered an agent. Good. Uh, let's increase relations with Sind. Sind will not be a vassal. Right. They will never be a vassal, which is fine. I, I don't really plan on invading uh, India all that much, so they can go crazy, I guess. I plan on pushing into Europe, though. Bulgarian? Wait, are they tribes? They're nomads? They have Eastern tech. Oh, they are step nomads. That's weird. All right, there you go. Gained the core provinces. Let's uh, convert that land. And now Coruscant. There it is. Good. So, boom. there you go. Making lots of money now? Yeah. Two more ducats. We can make a ton more. Oh, that's great. The development in uh, Persia really helps out. Let's give them more lands. Like right here. Three development provinces. Not really important. Uh, we're going to wait a couple a uh, couple more months. A couple more years, possibly. Depending on how, uh, how much our manpower increases. Also, Albania. We want to eat you. Covert actions. No, we can't build spy network? Ugh. We can't build it on them because they have an overlord. Right. And currently, Kazaria, you are allied with no one. That is good. That is very, very good. Ah, damn it. I forgot. I should have stayed over there. Ah, they're going to win. No, they aren't. Never mind. Utterly annihilated. We can't waste this uh, rise of Islam. We just simply cannot waste it. We need to spread as much as possible. Ooh, but... Byzantium. They're allied with the Visigoths. Oh, God, no. I will not be able to fight that. Byzantium and the Visigoths together? Simply is too much. Byzantium with the Visigoths. Yeah. Another 27. No. Impossible. Sad. I kind of wanted, you know, to be able to use the Rise of Islam to my advantage there. But guess not. But we can use it. Or can use all this military power. Because we're way too far ahead. We can only hold, yeah, 1,200, so. Where's the capital? Capital is Medina. Right. 
Although Baghdad and other areas of the sort, we use less power in. Huh. We can also convert all this culture. Because all that culture is currently Persian. Although I probably want to convert this culture first. Yeah, probably. Let's do that. Oh my god, that's 17. Never mind. All right, let's make a Bedouin. Bedouin. How have you Bedouin? Uh, get it? All right, Bedouin. And who do we have? So we have Mashriki, Bedouin, and Yemeni and Omani on our side. Okay. Good. And then, wait, what is this? Oh, Israeli. Right. The Israelis are a thing. They are their only culture. That would suck to be Israel. And be the only Jews and the only Israelians around you. It's just like, oh, yeah, no, great. Really, no allies ever. Khazar separatists. Ooh, yeah, Khazars. Increase in size so I can eat more of you. All right, fabricate claim, Dagestan. Let's get ready to declare war. There you go. And increase PID by 25. Good. Um, one of you need a leader, yeah. You guys get that leader. Ooh, awesome leader. It's just gonna help us out even more, Jesus. Um, no. You go that way, and you can siege. Good. Alright, now they're utterly crushed. We can't do anything with Alans. Alans guaranteed by Bulgaria, and they're allied with Avars and the Western Gulf Turks. Crap. Bulgaria! Volg uh, allied with Volga Borga Bulgaria, I have no idea who that is, and have Drevolans and Severians as vassals. Who are those? Are they like up here, I'm assuming? And Volga, Bor Volga Bulgaria, it's up there. Okay. Though I'm assuming they're pretty weak. Assuming. Not 100% on that. All right, we got to increase uh, some development. So go over here. Increase that development. Cool. And since we are technically in the medieval age, plagues aren't as bad, I believe. Uh, no. I believe you still can't get over 15, possibly more. Ooh, Tarek. Oh, it's still happening. Cool. Auto conversions. This, yeah, it's currently Tangri. And the more we conquer, the more it'll spread. The more it spreads, the more we take. The more everything we get. Jesus. We should probably declare war in Bulgaria while they're still falling apart. Alright, let's get someone in there. Build spy network. Yes. Dagestan joins us. Great. Heck, we could have attacked Byzantium and at least took in some lands, probably. But no, we shall go north. Byzantium, we shall, you know, wait for you. Speaking of waiting, I think we're done waiting for all of these infantrymen. So let's get 10 and 5. Call that an army. Save it up. There you go. Let's send them all there into, into Iraq. How much money are we making? 8.71, dear God. Okay, good for us. The risks of trade. Gain mercantilism. Yeah, I like mercantilism a lot. Alright, oh, we are done in Bulgaria. No, wait, that's not Bulgaria. Come on, take over Kazaria. We're the last of it. Maybe we can't. Maybe it won't let you eat it entirely. Maybe it just makes, makes you take... Just one bit of land. It's probably what's going to happen here, isn't it? Yeah, okay. We can end the war. Fine. Be stupid like that. At least they're Sunni, right? At least they're Sunni. Actually, you go there. And you can go up there. Oh my god, Bulgaria. The Khazar. They're all over that place. Maybe we should just wait it out. No. Oh, Khorasani. What, where is that? Oh, Khorasani over there. Cool. Well, no. Whatever. 
Just keep moving out. We shall... Oh, we're almost done. We shall begin the invasion of Bulgaria. Declare war. The new Persian culture is on the rise. Cool. Okay, so we shall be at war with Volga, Bul Bulgaria, Severans, and Drev Drevlians. Although, I believe we will take a ton of land from this because... Dear God, I don't think Bulgaria is very strong right now. How strong are they? Well, Rashidun, we currently have 54. Bulgaria. Currently at only 10,000. Yeah, we can win this. And I didn't even see... Well, who's Volga Bulgaria allied to? Bulgaria. So we can, we can call them in as a co-belligerent. Yes, and at 100 piety, we... Our morale of armies, plus that, where is it? The rise of Islam, which still exists for 15 years. So we're going to milk it. We are going to milk the rise of Islam dry. Right, take that over. We can push into them there. Go ahead. There's Volga, Volga Bulgaria. Or at least I believe that's who they are. No, go there. All right, and... Oh, they're not squished. Crap, they're going fast. Running around the speed of sound, man. Got places to go, gotta follow that rainbow. Sanic. It's Sanic the Hodgehog. Oh my god, are you seriously going all the way down there? That's pretty ridiculous, man. You're not even defending your own country anymore. Oh, hey, Bulgarian tribes are attacking us. Cool. I mean, we'll survive that easily, but still, it's like, Jesus Christ. We're actually helping your country, so don't complain. All right, who's converting? Anyone converting? They are converting. Good. All right. Done there. Ramadan. I don't, yeah, sure, game prestige. I, li I like... I like how um, Muslims have these options with piety. Like, you can easily gain a ton of prestige one, one day and easily lose it the other day. It's awesome. Alright, please crush that. Alright, they are crushed. Alright, you, my friend, are going up to Volga, Bulgaria. How's uh, Islam spreading? Not very good right now. It's fine. It's all, it's all good. It's all good in the Auburn hood. Alright. They are crushed. Yeah, we are obliterating the enemy here. At least on terms of morale. Um, yes! Another joins us. We need to crush them. An interesting development. Oh! Arabic culture spreading in Egypt. This is Egyptian Arab. Oh, so like the old Egyptians are dying... Or getting replaced by the Arabian Egyptians. Ooh. Interesting indeed. Oh my god, yep. Tons of Muslims coming in now. I love it. Sarai joins us. Great. Noble family feud. Eh, <laughs> family's feud. Diplo. Um, yes, another joins. Uh, we are full up on military power yet again. Let's go over to this land. And this land. There you go. New territory. Oh, culture. Converting. Good. Right, you're still going up. Right. You can move up there. Incorruptible. Maniac. Or Mainich joins us. That was Maniac. I'm like, what the heck? Alright. Yeah, we're destroying Tangri up here. Alright. I want you to arrive. Alright. Azaraba joins us. You guys need to go down there. And there you go. A donation. Yeah, we want to keep uh, piety up as much as possible. Ooh, we are low on manpower. As we expected, but we aren't losing that many due to morale. Or very high morale. Alright, gain the cores. 
Kuma joins us. Yeah. Sorry, Bulgaria, but this is our land now. Where's their capital? Okay, so that's their capital. Good to know. Good to know. All right. Uh, can't move up there. Who are we at war with? All right, so they're up here. That's uh, something I would like to know. Why can't you move? Oh, you can't move. Just it glitches like that all the time. Right, move there and there. It's freaking the amount of soldiers they have is just annoying. It's not even powerful. Not even terrifying. Not even threatening. Just slightly annoying. That's the power of Bulgaria and Volga Bulgaria for you. Oh, and they lost again. Nice. Although we are running low on manpower, so that means we can't reinforce. Which hurts us. But we can deal with that. Can we move up there? Still got some up here, man. Sarcasia joins us. How does it look now? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's spreading. It is spreading. Kuban joins us. We're right next to their capital now. Bulga Bulgaria owns that land now. Great. That joins us. I like how we're just having pockets of land to join us. It's kind of annoying. Kind of makes it look ugly. Give it a bit of... Oh my god. Level 5 shock. Gives it a bit of border gore, but you know. Alright, you're done. Um, move back down there. I guess. Oh my god, we... Okay, I thought we annihilated them, but nope. Alright, you guys... Okay, so they're going for their capital. That's fine. Ukek joins us. You've taken over Volga Bulgaria's capital. Horda joins us. Tin joins us. Karkov joins us. <laughs> uh, oh, great. Oh, Hungary! Damn it! Hungary, why do you have to be like that? This is our land, not your land. Great. Now it's just going to look ugly. As long as we can hold on to as much territory as is possible, we should be fine. All right, and you are gone. There we go. Canada. As of... We have spread into the Ukraine. This is kind of... I, okay, this is kind of ridiculous. This spread is just like, what? <laughs> but it's great. I like it. I like it. Lower Don joins us. Come on, really? I really... They're just... Just stop, okay? Just stop. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, there you go. Um... I don't know what that is. Whatever. Okay, so now we've discovered Hungary. Let us build spy networks because we got to eat them because they're going to eat some uh, Volga Bulgaria. Volga Bulgarian lands. That also go up there. Poor vintage. Oh no. But we gained piety for some reason. I guess people aren't getting drunk. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. Uh, great. Another joins us. Samara joins us. Join us. Join us all. Wait, who owns this land? Oh, that's occupied by Volga, Bulgaria, right? Okay, whatever. Oh, we are running very low on manpower. Oh, this hurts. This is hurting me. War exhaustion is not going up very high, though. Maybe it's... Oh, right. It's probably because it's the rise of Islam. Uh, no. No, it's just not going up. No, oh, whatever. Ramadan. Time to fast. Right, let's get rid of them there. Matrega joins us. Kursk joins us. Uh, fantastic. Yeah, we can recruit a lot more people now. We're making a lot more money as well. This is great. Just, just great, you know? Go up there. Lipsec joins us. Stop sieging the land. Just die, please. Please just die. 
It'd be amazing if you would. Bahamut joins us. Who's sieging what land? Ah, oh, they're down there! Just die already! Oh yeah, it's basically all Islamic land now. Great, great, great. I feel like this is going to end very badly. Like, once the uh, Rise of Islam ends, we're going to fall. Because there has to be, like, a collapse, right? It has to be. Really? I did not need this right now. <sighs> Alright, you go back down here and take them take care of them. And you can have the leader. We've spread so much somehow. Like seriously, what is up with this? Oh god, stop, stop it. Okay, yes, send them away. We are now considered a large empire. Oh, that's not good. Not good at all. And we have too much admin. Too much admin power. Something I thought I'd never say. Well, first of all, stability. And second of all, nothing. Um, I guess we can just increase some of these areas to orange. Yeah, guess that's about it. Uh, we also want Medina, obviously, wants to increase. Let's increase to 15. Good, more development. It's better days, better days for us. Oh, I see. So we're not we're not losing prestige. We're straight up just losing people. We just simply don't have enough people to go around. That's the big problem here. All right, but it looks as though we have occupied everything. Yeah, there you go. Occupations of everywhere. We have succeeded, and now we just wait for everyone to join. And everyone to convert. Yeah, lots of conversions necessary. Especially all the Chalcedonians. Oh my god. <laughs> Look how huge we are now. Syrian culture is spread. Wait, Syrians? Really? Oh, no, Syrians is good. Good, good. There's Assyrians, and then there's Syrian. That's weird how we have, like, a snake up there. It's gr like, b gross looking, but uh, good, nonetheless. Ah, and there we have it. Hungary is eaten. Volga, Bulgaria, it's over. Uh, we can't. We're not, I'm not going to declare war on them yet. I don't even think we have a claim on them. No, we don't. The Rise of Islam is still going on. For another nine years. They're not allied with anyone else. Oh, it was recently discovered. Oh, but we can still fabricate a claim. Good. Let's go to war with them. Beat the living crap out of them. And ensure the spread continues. Wiping out Hungary would be quite... Oh, are you joking right now? How old am I? 45? Ugh. I need a child. I mean, being a Muslim really helps with childbearing because, you know, multiple wives. But still. All right, beat the living crap out of Hungary. Win the war. End this. Or win this war. Really. And the rest of you just spread out. Trading in dies. All right, down there. Oh, and they're, I think they're trying to convert. Yeah, they're trying to convert. Yenisan joins us. <laughs> they're all joining us. Great. All right. All right, but you know what? Oh, crap. This is where I got to end this episode. Um, There has to be some... Something bad's about to happen. I swear, something bad has to happen at the end, the end of the Rise of Islam. Because right now, I think we're spreading... A little bit too much. Uh, yeah. We have become probably more powerful than Byzantium ever will become. But thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Ilya too, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.